So TPP have been working with Biobank for the last few years to ensure that we have a safe and secure method of transmitting the data. We're very proud to support all the people who have donated both their time, their data and their DNA uh, to tr make sure that the relevant records are transmitted. Only patients who have given their express permission will have their data transmitted by TPP and from, only from practices that have agreed for that transmission to occur. So when those two things are put together, we will then enable the data to move from TPP System 1 into UK Biobank in an anonymised, secure manner. TPP have been very proud to work with UK Biobank over a number of years following an initial data transfer. We feel very strongly that we want to support the people who have taken the time and effort to, no to donate their medical records and their DNA into this important project. The project uh, will enable the um, UK to be at the forefront of genetic research and we very much look forward to translating that research into very practical applications, both for those who have donated their data and of course for the rest of the country uh, in, within the NHS. From the very outset we felt it very important that the general practices are very comfortable with what is going on. So initially the practices must of course understand what data has been transmitted, the way it's been transmitted and hopefully they'll be very comfortable with that approach. Once they've decided they are happy, then all the practice has to do is to sign the agreement with UK Biobank and tick a box within System 1. Once that box has been ticked, then they have no further actions that they have to take. We will undertake the data extraction automatically. TPP, of course, um, has one of the largest databases of um, GP data in the world um, in System 1. So it's been very important that we have the opportunity to support UK Biobank by transmitting the data from our databases into the research arena. Um, we can only do that, of course, with the consent of the data subject and, of course, the data controller. And the work we've been doing over the recent years is to ensure that that is absolutely watertight and everybody can be signed up and happy with the process so that the project can move forward very rapidly.